Can you hear me now? Hey guys, I know a lot of you are um, probably on a pretty tight budget when it comes to gaming, and a lot of you like to use some sort of um, TeamSpeak solution while you're gaming with friends, whether that be just using a Skype call, or whether it be the Cursed Voice app, or, or any of a number of other solutions that you could be using, but today we're looking at a couple solutions that help you stay on a budget without having to spend a lot of money on a brand new gaming headset, and these solutions will help you utilize some of the audio solutions um, that you may already have, whether that be a nice pair of headphones that you just really like, or whether it be something as simple as Apple EarPods, which we are also going to take a little bit of a look at. But one of the microphones I am focusing on today is the Sony um, ECM-CS3, which right now on Amazon, I'm looking at it over here, looks like you can have it for just under $20, um, which is about half the cost of some of the entry-level gaming headsets that you can find elsewhere. So we're going to compare that as well as the EarPods from Apple to things like my lavalier mic system that I use for my videos, as well as a Blue Yeti microphone, which is just over my um, right shoulder here. So um, let's go ahead and hop into it. And I have a little bit of a special sort of can you guess which one I'm using type thing to look at here before we go ahead and identify them. So let's go ahead and jump into this blind test. And what you're going to be doing here, or what's going to be happening, is you will see probably some random just stock footage of someone flying around in the countryside or in a city or something. But the microphones you're going to be hearing from are going to be the Apple EarPods. You're going to hear from the Sony mic that's just under $20. You're going to hear from the Samsung um, Airline Micro Lavalier System, which is what I'm currently using. And you're also going to hear the audio from the Blue Yeti. So we have four things that you're going to be hearing audio from. I'm not going to give you any indication which one comes when because it's going to be completely blind to you. And your job here is to guess which audio solution you think you're hearing and then I'll reveal those at, um, at the end and you can sort of get the comparison then of what type of audio you're hearing. So without further ado, let's hop right into that blind test. Let's go ahead and queue up some stock footage and we will go ahead and listen to these mics. Also, I will note that there will be absolutely no post-processing done on these mics. This will be as it's fed into the computer, so you may hear a little bit of a hiss from some of them, uh, more or less from different ones, and you'll just have to sort of take that with a grain of salt, um, and that's really the explanation of what we're doing here. Let's hop right to it. This is a simple scripted message. I wanna to talk today about my own channel because I have an ego that needs fed, and I'm just rambling in this script, so on to the next audio sample. This is a simple scripted message. I want to talk today about my own channel because I have an ego that needs fed, and I'm just rambling in this script, so on to the next audio sample. This is a simple scripted message. I want to talk today about my own channel because I have an ego that needs fed, and I'm just rambling in this script, so on to the next audio sample. This is a simple scripted message. I want to talk today about my own channel because I have an ego that needs fed and I'm just rambling in this script. So on to the next audio sample. Okay, so that was the audio samples. Now um, here once again are your options and here are the correct answers in the order they were actually put up there. Um, so if you need to go back and look over those with the answers in mind, um, go for it. I would encourage that. Also, something else to note is this entire last little segment here for me reve revealing those answers is being done using that Sony clip-on mic, the least expensive. However, this audio is with a little bit of post-processing to take out a little bit of the um, excess noise that may be in that um that microphone, but all in all, it's a really great value for if you just need to add a microphone for simple things like Skype and you already have headphones that you really like. Um, another good option was those Apple EarPods. They were actually really great. Um, they, they didn't have a lot of background noise. Obviously, the Blue Yeti being second, that was the, the best quality audio because it's feeding directly into the PC. Um, and the Samsung Airline uh, lavalier system has more noise than some of the other ones. I don't think quite as much as the Sony uh, clip-on mic that I'm using now. 
Um, but obviously when I'm doing videos, that all gets, or for the most part, gets removed in post-processing. And it also gives me the freedom that I need to move around as I need to without having to worry about a mic being situated correctly. So that's why I use that. So go back, listen to those audio samples again. Let's go ahead and um, head into my outro, um, I guess, where I give you shameless self-plugs for my own amusement. Okay, hopefully you enjoyed this little overview of um, some decent and cheap audio solutions for your microphone needs as a gamer. Um, the Sony option that I'm holding here is a great option as well as the Apple EarPods or more expensive options like the Blue Yeti behind me or the Samson Airline um, system that I'm using right now. So um, if you enjoyed this video, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below, that like button down below. Also, you can follow me on Twitter at Hoosier Hardware. It should be somewhere up on the screen right now. And don't forget to check out some of my other videos, which there will be a card somewhere up here. Have a great day, guys.